The tip and temperature selection system is a convenient reference for choosing a temperature for your application and provides other important information. Setting and maintaining a proper tip temperature is essential for safe, effective operation of your ThermoTwees handpiece. To set tip temperature, first turn the power on. If your system has an installed password, it must be entered first. The password will consist of a combination of keystrokes. Before setting tip temperature, First note the channel powering your ThermoTwees. Then press the channel select key until the LED for the channel powering your handpiece illuminates. To set tip temperature, press the tip set key and immediately enter your desired tip temperature using the scroll keys. On single channel digital display systems, follow a similar procedure. On Sensitemp systems with a dial display, simply adjust the control knob for the channel powering your thermotwees to your desired tip temperature. As with any heating system, large surface mount tips lose heat much more quickly than smaller tips, causing the true tip temperature to be much lower than the set temperature. This difference in temperature is called tip temperature offset. Pay Sensitemp systems with digital displays feature auto tip temperature offset compensation, which lets you set and display honest, accurate temperatures for any size and type of tip. To assure the most accurate tip temperature, turn to the ThermoTwee section of the Tip and Temperature Selection System and identify the tip installed in the handpiece. For digital display systems, enter the tip offset constant which corresponds to the installed tip by first pressing the tip offset key, then the scroll keys until the correct value appears in the display. Now press the set key and enter your desired tip temperature. The true tip temperature will appear in the display. For dial display systems, select a true tip temperature, then adjust the control knob to the corresponding dial setting. For more specific information on setting the tip temperature, consult the introduction of the tip and temperature selection system or your handpiece manual. The ThermoTwees handpiece is designed to operate efficiently at safer lower tip temperatures. For most surface mount removal applications, use the lowest tip temperature which will provide rapid yet controllable melt of all the solder joints. To increase tip life and reduce the possibility of damage, begin with a tip temperature of 315 degrees Celsius or 600 degrees Fahrenheit. Adjust temperature as necessary to suit your particular application. On extra heavy multi-layer boards or boards with ground planes, it may be necessary to increase the tip temperature to achieve rapid, complete solder melt of all the joints. However, True tip temperatures over 400 degrees Celsius or 750 degrees Fahrenheit can greatly increase the risk of damage. Remember to always follow your organization's tip temperature guidelines for each particular application. Surface mount removal on extra heavy boards will be discussed later in Part 5. Next, in Part 4, we'll learn about handpiece, tip, and work preparation.